Good morning, everybody. So today is June 1, which means you have access, actually you had access last Thursday or Friday, um, to your Coursera platform. Um, if you were just, if I just saw your email, because I was out Friday, um, and then there was Saturday and Sunday, um, I, I just gave you access if you reached out to me Thursday or Friday. Anyways, so everybody should have access to the Coursera platform for either Hawking College, Belmont, or Washington State Community College, and um, should be able to get started, you know, at your own convenience. So some questions that I've had so far is accessing Google Drive. Um, I think it's a security parameter. I don't know in regards to um, why, even though I say it's open to the public, it's still giving some of you guys some issues on accessing it and i just blame it on tech and you're gonna realize the more you work in this field computers are stupid <laughs> and you know you just gotta go with it and figure it out and problem solve and troubleshoot and just do whatever needs to work around okay so if you have experience you already know that if you don't have experience yet just get in that mindset of computers are stupid tech is stupid sometimes and even though it should work it's not okay you just got to figure out what to do it's important not to just throw in the towel and give up you got to kind of stay with it and figure out problem solve troubleshoot so the only thing i have in this um the shared folder that i created is the welcome and the learner guide and some of you guys are having trouble accessing that and it looks like i may have given you the link to the actual the one of the links that i gave you earlier was actually to the document as opposed to the google drive I think whenever I maybe copied and pasted it, um, the wrong link was still saved in, in my clipboard and pasted it. So some of you guys are accessing um, it whenever the link I give you, you guys are accessing this particular link, this particular document. It goes straight into here, which is fine. It's not a big deal. But I got in this email that um, I'm sending and in the comments below on this YouTube video, I'm sending you the link, hopefully, to the actual Google Drive folder. And I know it's still contrary. It's just like I said, you know, the beginning of this video, tech can be stupid sometimes. So once you get that link, that Google Drive link, that I'll, again, I'm putting in the comments um, on this video, if you're seeing this on YouTube or in the email, if you're accessing it, this video through email, whatever it is that you're doing. Um, so let me go ahead. So once you access the link and you sign into your Gmail account, you probably do need to have a Gmail account. I don't know if there's a workaround um, to not having a Gmail account or not using a Gmail account. You guys gonna have to kind of play with that on your own and let me know what happens. And then we can figure out what the process to be to work around that. So I'm actually going to sign in with um, a non-Hawking College email, just another Gmail account that I have, and click Next. And this should hopefully go step by step, play by play, of what you need to do to access it on your own. So hit Next, and then I enter my password. Okay, so then this is what you guys should be seeing. Um, you can put a message, whatever access you don't need to put a message on here hit request access request sent okay so that means I will get an email saying you need access and I don't know why it does this even though I said anybody with the link should be able to access it I don't know if computers are stupid sometimes um, we just gotta you know play by their rules um, but hopefully this will help and if you have any questions let me know thank you